वेलकम टू द लेटेस्ट अपडेट प्रोग्राम द टॉपिक ऑफ डिस्कशन इज नासा स्पॉट्स एयरी होल्स इन क्लाउड्स अब फ्लोरिडा रिसेंटली नासा टेरा सेटेलाइट कैप्चर्ड अ स्ट्रेंज इमेज ऑफ द स्काई अब द गल्फ ऑफ मैक्सिको एंड जस्ट ऑफ द कोस्ट ऑफ फ्लोरिडा विच रिवील सम ऑड एयरी होल्स इन द क्लाउड्स साइंटिस्ट हैव लॉन्ग स्पेक्यूलेटेड अबाउट दीज क्लाउड्स रेफर टू एज केवम क्लाउड्स होल पंच क्लाउड्स और फॉल स्ट्रीक होल्स एंड दीज आर कॉज्ड बाय एरोप्लेन्स This is not the first time that such holes have been spotted. Let's now discuss how are cavum clouds formed. Cavum clouds form when aeroplanes pass through layers of alto cumulus clouds which are mid-level clouds containing super cooled water droplets, water below freezing temperature but still in liquid form. As the aircraft moves through, a process known as adiabatic expansion can cause the water droplets to freeze into ice crystals. These ice crystals eventually become too heavy and fall out of the cloud layer. creating a hole in the clouds various types of aircraft including large passenger jets regional jets private jets military jets and turbo props could generate either cavum or canal clouds when passing through clouds cavum clouds form when planes pass through at a relatively steep angle while canal clouds characterized by long burga trails occur when planes pass through at a shallower angle now is the time to test your knowledge the question is how are cavum clouds formed by volcanic activity by earthquakes by aircraft passing through alto cumulus clouds or by gravitational forces send the answer to this question in the comment section thanks for watching for more informative content like share and subscribe and do not forget to press the bell icon to get the notifications